TNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here. This is the 10th of January. This is Tuesday. The Dow is up 53 at 32,570 for this Tiger Financial News Network 10 a.m. market update. Powell's talking overseas. So far, there's been quite a nice response. You can see just real quickly, I'll show you the E-minis, how they've popped very nicely. This is at 8.30 right here when others were talking, and I don't know if Powell's on right this moment. But we have uh, spiked all the way to 39.27 in the e-mini. Uh, we'll see if we're going to give that back or if it's going to continue. But the most important thing right now is that in the, deep, the, the Dow had a, a reversal yesterday after almost hitting 34,000. Pullback did a Chapman Wave Roman candle, some of the I'll, I'll discuss when we get back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. It really needs to get to the 33,650 area sometime today. That'll be a positive. We'll see what happens. S&P Held a little bit better. Uh, it is now up 483, 550 actually, at 3897. It, it needs it needs to get to the 3910 area at least, 3920, over the next hour. That'll be a positive. QQQ NDX 100 trading up 52 cents at 271.10. Actually had a bit better action yesterday than the Dow and the S and P. That needs a lot more to go. It needs to get to 277 over the next uh, four or five sessions. There's a 270 right now. IWM, the Russell 2000, up 24 cents at 178, holding quite nicely. Gold, this is going to be very interesting because gold is just holding beautifully right here. It's up five at 1883. Leg C in the weekly, leg D so far, still standing in the daily. We're going to be looking at that over the period of the day. Does it go higher? Does it start a pullback? Talking about a pullback, the, the dollar is down nine cents at 103. It's really struggling. And if you go to crude oil, crude oil did have a rally yesterday, gave some of it back. It's up 29 cents at 74. It needs 77 to really show that it's got upside strength. The TLT, that's bonds, trading down $1.29. So yields. Are uh, actually running a little bit here, but they've been in steady mode. I'll be back for the Tiger Technicians Hour and check out my opening call. Canadian News here. See you in a few moments.